What's up, people? <clears throat> I'm back for my second vlog today. And it's been something that's on my mind. And I got to talk about it before I forget about it. So let me let me let me let y'all know that I am a Gemini, pure 100 percent. I'm in the middle of the month. I'm not in the beginning. I'm not in the end mixed with cancer in the beginning mixed with a Taurus. I am 100 percent Gemini. So I'm going to change my mind a thousand times a day. People used to people still ask the question, who's better? Who's the better MC, Biggie Smalls or Tupac? And for the longest, I've been saying Tupac. Why? Because me and Tupac share the same birthday, so I've been stubborn. And I can listen to Tupac songs and get something from them. Get some motivation. Like, get, like, like Tupac has so many types of songs like different songs like and it's all hip-hop but he just it's so different like all the songs are different some of them uplift you some of them make you want to go to war some some of them make you fight for what you believe in so i was saying that tupac is better than big because of that like i don't like i hate the fact that biggie be like i'll suck your daddy dick like i don't i don't like that i don't like that like people gave big a pass for saying stuff like that and it's like like, uh, like, nah, not me. Like, like, but at the further consideration and at the hearing all the stories that people tell about Tupac, about how he do a song, listen to it once and then move on to the next one. And I'm listening to Tupac songs, man. And it's like, there's so many features on his songs. So it's like, he has so many artists to help him with a song. Nobody's writing for Tupac. That's not what I'm saying. No ghost writing. But you'll have him do a song, then you'll have some outlaws come in, then you'll have Snoop, and you have like just so many artists helping him with the song. You'll have an R and B dude on the hook. Big Big kinda was very creative with his songs, man. I'll keep it a hundred with you. Like he got songs where he's like three different characters in one song. He's got songs where the storytelling is so vivid, it's incredible. You know what I mean? He's like he and it's just him five minute long songs him just going at it like i never thought big was the best lyricist in the world but if you want to go the best storyteller you can say that i still think Nas is the best i think Nas tells stories too very vivid and i think Nas is like the overall greatest mc of all time to me but between biggie and Pac, man i'm telling y'all now i'm changing my pick i'm going with big now i think big is better than Pac. i think i think we're I think with the Pac situation, I just think that we, we, I think we like Pac as a whole, like forget music, like we wish Pac was still alive because he, we know he'd be at the forefront standing up for what he believe in right now, like getting on the mic and telling whoever to kiss his ass, you know what I'm saying? So I think we like Tupac overall, just as a person, Biggie. I think it's just a music thing with Big. Like, it's nothing Big did outside music to where you'd be like, damn. You know, Big was a big, big was a revolutionary type of person. Like, he just was an MC who battled, made great songs, man. So, Pac or Big? I gotta go with Big as of now. Both of them Gemini's, by the way. So, ain't nobody losing. Both of them Gemini's. The camera's right there. I keep looking over there, but the camera's right here. The eye's right there. So um, let me know what y'all think, man. Why do you think Tupac is better than Big? Why do you think Big is better than Tupac? Once again, I've been saying Tupac is better for the longest, but now I'm going with Big just for the fact that Big, he beat like, okay. And you could say, well, if it wasn't for Puff Daddy, Big would not have had the success. But we're not going to go with that. We're just going to go with what they had. What they were doing. If you look at big songs, whether big, that's another thing. They said big didn't even write his rhymes. So you got to look at the songs that big put together and look at the songs that Pac put together. And majority of Pac songs had, he had other artists on them. Big kind of went in and did his own thing, two to three verses, his own hooks. Like, I mean, don't get me wrong, he had 112 on some. You know what I'm saying? He had, a, he had some RB hooks on some. But majority was him killing somebody else's remix, making it his, and doing his own songs. So and at the end of the day, I can't say that for Pac. Like all the all the songs they play on the re Hail Mary. Besides Hail Mary, 
me and my girlfriend, Dear Mama, um, I mean, Pac's got some songs spread out. Pac's got more albums, too. Big got, Big had two albums before he passed. Um, but um, Pac's, Pac, Pac's got some songs where he did by himself, but if you listen to his album, it's like they kind of helped him. You know what I mean? Because Pac wasn't really focusing on the song. Like, making, he wasn't trying to make one song its best version. He did his verse, listened to it once, and then he left and did something else. Big kind of like mastered his songs. So as of right now, I'm going to go with the Notorious B.I.G. And maybe because I'm in Gemini, I'll change it uh, tomorrow. By the way, make sure you subscribe. Camera's right there again. Make sure you subscribe to the page, man. Just hit the button. Show some support, man. Um, Like the video. Um, find this, find me and my, my brother and I on iTunes, my, uh, the, the pod, damn, the podcast brothers, the podcast brothers on iTunes, Google play, man. Uh, we on SoundCloud too. Subscribe to the page. I'm going to leave some links on the bottom. Click on them. Subscribe to those too, man. Just show some support, man. Leave your boy a comment too, man. Let me know what you think of the video. Once again, I'm going Biggie over Tupac, but I might change my mind tomorrow.